Hey guys, what's up? It's Zach Prepare, so I come back with another video here today, and this is on a little unboxing I got from Evic. So let's get started. I ordered two things from Evic. And inside we get empty and two things we just what I ordered and a little old pamphlet and that stuff like usual and so the two items I ordered was the Odin Innovations M12 Sidewinder Speed Loader whatever you want to call it whatever you know what are you going to say and I ordered an LBL LBX uh, belt for my um, my assaulter's belt. It's right there, and here it is. So just a quick video on a little bit of unboxing I got, and thanks guys, Dr. Barbarasoft signing out. Hey guys, what's up? It's Dr. Barbarasoft coming back in another part of this video. Um, earlier I did the Odin Speedwinders unboxing with the LBX belt and I have another unboxing I got a couple days later so I might as well throw it into this video as well for today. So uh, this was a quick unboxing I got from Global Osprey Global um, a part of my three times magnification sight part broke on the base part and I'll show you that in a second and so I called them up and they were they were able to send me what the part for free and it was awesome so thanks guys over there and so this is the little part they sent me I already unboxed it to make sure everything was correct and it, they have a lifetime warranty on all their sites and all their parts so please go check them out uh, people were asking in the comments below what kind of sites I use I use Osprey Global HD 552 and the three times magnification site so go check it out in the products uh, the description in, in the description below a link to their website will be available and so this is the little part that I was able to get and this is the part that holds this in it was like there we go like that and that's how it clips in your gun with this part on the rail and it pops open like that when you don't want to use it when you do use it you just look through there like that and then this is the other side of my site and this is the magnification I use um, when I went to Badwood I believe I used this I can't remember exactly but I think I used it there and that's how it works when you don't want to use it you just cook this little side and that's the part I got and now I'm going to show you how you use it and put it on your gun so let me get my gun open so I keep my gun inside this case and I already have on my site now. I already have on my replica Eotech Osprey Global site, which I really love. It takes just two AA batteries, and it's really nice. And I have that, like that, and that's what I use. So then, this is the part that broke. You see, if I can compare it, it was. It was like that, and this part. It was basically in half. See, I, see, it's only on the top part, like that. And you're missing this whole top section where it connects. And, like, the little ball sticking out. And As you can see, it's like a different color. I think it's a more, it's a newer version than what I had. My part just broke during a game. And I couldn't figure out how to fix it. Like, I had the parts. I think I was missing a couple. There's a couple little silver nubs that go into here that fell out, but I couldn't even try to fix it back to kind of having to use it. So let me fast forward me taking this off and I'll get back to you. Now, I already took off this part right now really quick, and this is how small it is. And everything's um, just seems kind of broken. I don't really know the exact issue of this, other than it's just really broken so then I fixed it and I had this new one on and I'll take off the site first and see it clips in like that into those little parts and let me get it this on first Right. 
Alright, got that on nice and snug. I got it just where I want it, just like that. I think it looks good there. That's where I had the older, the other one. And it goes on like this. This part is facing you. This is the tube that you're able to see through. Look at that. So. Alright. Now let me let me get it all zoomed in and let's see if you guys can try it out. So there you go. You can kind of, kind of get an idea of how it works. Like that. See? That's how you aim with it. You can kind of see the red dot. Okay guys. So earlier you saw the unboxing of the LBX Fast Belt. And now I have it working consistently with my LBX um, Assaulter's Belt. So I have it on my pants. I have it with the insert and everything with my LBX pants as well so now when you put on these pants you put them on with the inner belt first and they recommend having an outer belt there's an area to put for an outer belt so well, like that and then you take this belt and you put it through here and there we go we have my belt on and ready to go. So, I don't think I did that 100%. Okay. So what you do is you put it on like this. Up through here. Back up like that. So, I have my belt on and all secured. And that's how you're supposed to wear it. You're supposed to have an inner belt, some type of riggers or some type of belt inside. And that's how you wear it to keep it all fit. So this is my belt and this is how it works. Uh, I use it in a game and I really like it. I have all my postures and everything. And there's no more issues with dangling before I use this piece of paracord. And that worked okay. It didn't really keep it 100% secure. But it worked for what I was using it for a couple games. But then I got this belt and it works fantastic. So moving on to the Odin Speed. Okay guys, so for the Odin Speed Rider you need three things. A magazine, the Odin Speed Rider, and BBs. So to use this, um, just a quick overview of this. It takes 1,600 rounds. It says own Speedwinder. M12, Sidewinder, Speedwinder, whatever you want to call it. So to work this, first you fill the top part with BBs. And there's a whole bunch of instructions on the side of the um, packaging. But I already got rid of the packaging. So I'm just going to show you what I, can, what I know what best works for me. Which is the same thing as they do, but... You load up with BBs, it can take 1600, you close it on this little top part like that, then you come over here and you undo the little side winder, take your empty magazine, click it in, right there, and you just start twisting. Until it starts like doing a double click, then you come to this side, press it, and you're good to go. It's always already loaded. Um, I have not used the Evike or the Elite Force uh, fast, the their shotgun style, whatever they call it, speed loader. I've only used this one. And compared to what other people say about the other one, um, from what I've used with this one, I think this one is much uh, faster and more consistent without the rattling and shaking. And you can use this. It's a lot easier to use in. Um, Milsim games and stuff like that or longer games you can play with you can stick this in like a double uh, M4 mag pouch and you're good to go versus the shotgun where you have to put in the, or whatever it's called you put in different pouches and use it so that's a quick little review of this that I was using and hopefully if anyone had any uh, concerns or issues with this I helped anyone out I showed you my, and I showed you my Global Ostrich product and uh, please I cannot uh, stress enough how you guys should check out the Global Ospreys uh, scopes, accessories, mounts, different uh, reflex sights and all that stuff. They're wonderful. They have amazing products for a reasonable cost and they help me out with lifetime warranty and all that jazz and it's um, it was great working with those guys on sending me a new part and they were more than pleased to help me out. So I want to give a shoot, uh, uh, huge shout out to the men and women who work over at Global Ospreys for sending this product for me to um, to fix the, the issue that broke and and it was just a great product. Please, I'll have a link in the description for their website and go check it out. Thanks, guys. Dr. Peppersoft, signing out. <laughs>